The performance of a sales manager is influenced by the operations and policies of other departments such as marketing, production, finance, and HR. So this case is about managing interdepartmental relations and the importance of interdepartmental relationship management for a sales manager. So here's the background of the case. Maraj is a college dropout who has moved up the corporate ladder from a field sales representative to a regional sales manager in just 10 years. Maraj has it all what it takes to be an excellent sales manager, the personality, attitudes, skills, and knowledge. Minhal has recently joined the organization as head of HR. She just came back after a completion of her master's in HR from University of Oxford. In her, in her first three months, she made some policy changes and the top management seems convinced that she will transform the organization. She advises a new policy in which all the hiring of grade four and above employees will have a minimum criteria of master's education. Maraj wants his sales hiring to be excluded from this policy as he believes that education is irrelevant in the field of sales management. So here's the first situation. Maraj confronts Minhal by stating that HR should focus on the menial tasks and stay away from the sales department. Maraj threatens to resign if this policy is not retracted. Minhal decides to walk away from the situation. Hello, Maraj. Can you hear me? Yes. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm fine. I heard that you've contracted COVID, so I hope you're taking good care of your health. Yeah, I got tested a couple of days ago, and I guess I'm doing fine now. That's good to hear. So, you wanted to hold an emergency meeting. Is everything fine? Uh, no. Nothing is good as I left. Uh, the thing is, you have introduced HR ke new policies in the organization. Mein. This may आप से ईमेल रिक्वेस्ट है कि आप प्लीज उसको सेल्स से तो बिल्कुल अलग रखें बाकी आपके जो फंक्शंस हैं डिपार्टमेंट के मार्केटिंग और एटसेट एटसेट वो चल सकते हैं लेकिन प्लीज इसको सेल्स से दूर रखें सेल्स में इस तरह नहीं होता कोई डिग्री की आपने रिक्वायरमेंट डाल दी डिग्री की कोई रिक्वायरमेंट नहीं होती आपने अगर पहले काम किया होगा तो आपको पता होना चाहिए कि सेल्स बिल्कुल अलग होता है यहां पे सेल्स में हम हायरिंग करते हैं हम पेरोल बनाते हैं सब हम करते हैं सो आपका इसमें कोई रोल नहीं है सो आप प्लीज इसको अलग करें वरना मेरा यहां पे काम करना बहुत ज्यादा मुश्किल हो जाएगा मारेज आई अंडरस्टैंड योर कंसर्न लेकिन अगर आप यहां नॉलेज और एक्सपीरियंस से बैठे हैं तो मैं भी यहां नॉलेज और एक्सपीरियंस के साथ बैठी हूं और अगर मैंने मैंने ये पॉलिसी बनाई है सो देयर इज अ रीजन बिहाइंड इट बिकॉज़ एजुकेशन नॉट ओनली इंक्रीजेस योर नॉलेज it enhances your skills and it allows you to explore more opportunities it allows you to grow personally and professionally lekin agar aapne itni um uh intense aapka decision ho sakta hai if uh, we implement this policy uh, on the sales department as well so i feel like um chale sahi hai phir aapki maan lete hain and uh, i'll uh, let you take over this Yes, please, as soon as possible. Sure. Thank you so much. In the second situation, Minhal gives Maraj a shut-up call. She tells Maraj to focus on his work and not interfere in the matters of HR. Minhal puts Maraj on the defensive by stating that he does not have to be worried because the policy is only for new employees. Maraj feels insulted and demotivated. हेलो मिनाल मुझे आपसे कुछ जरूरी बात करनी थी और वो ये थी कि आपकी जो नई सेल्स की जो जो आपकी एचआर की पॉलिसी है उससे आप प्लीज सेल्स को एक्सक्लूड रखें इससे मेरे डिपार्टमेंट में बहुत ज्यादा इफेक्ट होने वाला है आर यू टॉकिंग अबाउट द वन वेयर वी हैव मेड मास्टर्स डिग्री मैंडेटरी फॉर ग्रेड फॉर एन अदर एम्प्लॉई यस ओके एंड व्हाई डू यू थिंक सो आई थिंक इस सेल्स में आपकी कोई डिग्री की कोई रिक्वायरमेंट नहीं होती सेल्स में इट्स ऑल अबाउट फील्ड इट्स ऑल अबाउट योर इंटरपर्सनल स्किल्स सो देयर इज नो रिक्वायरमेंट फॉर एनी डिग्री 
I am sitting as a regional sales manager without a degree. Maharaj, I have I respect your opinion and I have listened to what you have to say. But can you please please stay away from from the HR stuff and whatever we do. Uh, it will make you focus on your department and let me focus on my department. If you are sitting there with knowledge and experience, I am sitting here with knowledge and experience as well. अगर आप कुछ कर रहे हैं कुछ सोच समझ के कर रहे होंगे लेकिन मैं अगर एच आर के काम कर रही हूँ मैं आपके सेल्स के काम में बिल्कुल इंक्लूड नहीं होती तो इट्स बेटर कि आप अगर एच आर के काम में आ, अपने आप को इंटरफेयर ना करने दें ऑल्सो इन केस यू थिंक के आपकी जॉब इस चीज से थ्रेटन हो रही है बिकॉज ऑफ द न्यू पॉलिसी दैट वी मे जस्ट नो दैट इट्स फॉर द न्यू एम्प्लॉय सो यू डोंव टू फील यू डोंव टू बी इनसिक्योर अबाउट एनी थिंग ये सिर्फ नए एम्प्लॉयज के लिए है तो I hope that you understand my concern as well, and and I hope that you stay away from the HR task. Okay, आप सही कह रही हैं कि मुझे अपना काम करना चाहिए तो शायद आपको पता होगा कि sales के hiring हम खुद करते हैं, sales के सारे काम भी हम खुद करते हैं, HR को उससे कोई ताल्लुक नहीं होता, लेकिन अब ऐसा है तो फिर मेरा इस तरह काम करना मुश्किल हो जाएगा. Yeah, this is what we'll have to do. I'm sorry, there's no other solution. Thank you so much, Mike. Let me do my work. You can do your work. Yeah, definitely. Thank you so much. In the third situation, Marij explains how requirement of sales managers are different from all other functions. In Hal explains the importance of having education in this technology oriented era. They reach out to a common ground by balancing the criteria for shortlisting. Hello, Min Hal. Hello, Marij. How are you? Uh, I am good. Uh, I just wanted to discuss about the HR policies and how it's different from sales. Like how other, as compared to other department, how it's like different. Okay, so you're basically talking about the latest policy that I've seen. Ah uh, yes, the no. thing is, uh, why I think is uh, like selling is different. Uh, because selling is all about how you act on a field okay it's all about the network it's all about the personality and why the degree is not required is because i think selling is more about convincing and selling skills cannot be taught cannot be transferred from a one person to another person okay i think is what i also believe is most of our star employees and most of our Sellers don't even know. They are unconscious about how they do sales, but they do sales. So it's kind of an art, which uh, we just uh, examine or we just uh, find in a person by examine by, by through examination of like personality assessment and techniques, the approaches he is uh, going for. So it's all about that. It's nothing related to the degree. Okay. I understand your concern. Uh, you're absolutely right. I would just like to add one point. It's the fact that I you would obviously know sales better because you have um, you're on such a high position. But one thing that I would like to highlight is the importance of education over here. Okay. Um, while making the policy, I had one thing in mind. It's the fact that education. Does not only really allow you to grow uh, professionally, but it also allows you to grow personally. It allows you to grow. It allows you to, you know, explore more opportunities as well. And especially when we're living in a technology-oriented era, let me remind you that technology is everywhere. It will be included in the sales field as well. And in that specific case, technology cannot be taught on the field. it has to be taught through formal education okay so if you i understand that uh, street smartness and everything uh, a person has to possess to be a sales person so what we can do is that we can reach to a common ground and um, you can tell me some of the requirements that you think are important uh, while considering a candidate we can think of some courses you can tell me some of the important courses like diploma courses uh, we're not really asking for a whole masters degree but bachelors should be there you agree with me 
on that right uh partially i agree because i think is no uh, institute of a particular sales degree bachelor's degree what we can go for is uh, courses like consumer behavior courses or we can uh, make students go through the numerous buying uh, cycles of uh, bank cycles and like how to make a basic call and how to communicate and how to uh, like transfer the buyer in as uh, a customer okay uh, since we're talking about grade 4 and above employees i feel like for that specific grade uh, bachelors is very important sahi hai bachelors mein aapki consumer behavior aur ye sare courses aa hi jate hain lekin grade 4 aur grade 4 ke above ke baad hum bachelors ko mandate karke instead of mass masters degree hum koi aise courses diploma courses mandate kar sakte hain which you think whichever courses you feel like they uh, like whichever courses you feel like they're important ke us sales candidate ke paas honi chahiye we can um, surely make that a part of the job description and the job analysis yeah i guess that will work for me and also along with that uh, as you mentioned that this is uh, only applicable on new hirings so i have couple of uh, my employees in mind as promotions or transfers so i believe uh they'll not be affected by this sir yes uh, it won't be affected you don't have to worry about that uh ye sirf hamare naye employees ke liye hai jo ab aayenge so um aapke current team or aap they're not in the new employees on on a particular grade below that as a salesman we can go for like any person as we usually do yes yeah we can Yeah, I guess okay. uh, we are good to go. Yeah, thank you so much, Mike. Thank you. I'm really glad that you talked about. Oh uh, yes, so thank you so much.